Ashley would find me on the playground and grab me and be like, Maya's sad, you gotta cheer her up with a story. Hey, uh, good news. I made it into a 99 second story slam and I would love to see you show up on Sunday and cheer me on. I had this indomitable bro crush on these two girls. Ashley had this poofy blonde hair and a splatter shot of freckles across her face. She was pleading with her best friend, Maya. Cheer up, Maya, cheer up. Maya was this dour girl in straight hair and just sour face. She was constantly thinking about college and her family and her grades and she was just that kind of second grader like ashley i became obsessed with trying to figure out how to make maya smile i'd think up all these different ways to cheer her up tell her stories and jokes and things like that and we became really close friends so much so that Ashley would find me on the playground and grab me and be like, Maya's sad, you gotta cheer her up with a story. And I'd run over and I would tell her some fantastic thing. This one time I told her my favorite story, which was about how I trapped a devil into a walnut. And I did it with exaggeration and bombast. And she's just rolling on the grass laughing. And when everything calmed down, she locked eyes with me and she gave me this little piece of wisdom. Dan, just because you made me laugh doesn't mean I forgot that sad thing. I spent a year being these girls' friends, and we talked about depression all the time. Looking back on it now, it was kind of a strange second grade year. That thing that she tried to tell me in that moment and in other moments that I couldn't fix the sadness inside her. It took years and probably some bad relationships before it sunk in. You know, laughter can be helpful, but a lot of times there's underlying problems there. There's stuff going on, and you can't always address that with just a silly story. Some kids have more than a drop of wisdom. She was one of them. Thanks for listening, and I hope you have a great day, or evening, or whenever you're watching this. Bye. Like, subscribe, and come check out the show on Sunday if you're watching this before Sunday the something or other. Probably February. <laughs>